Hi everyone, this is Leo from Barry Rockets, and in this lesson, we will introduce the get pixel color and also the test joint functions in App Inventor. So let's start by putting three components, and they are what we need in this lesson. First, we need a canvas, which is under um, the drawing and animation tab here. And we also need a ball to um, show where we touched. And lastly, the label to display the RGB values of the pixel. So after we have set up a canvas, a ball, and also the label, we need a, an image. So I um, suggest to search for a color view image on Google and we set it to our background image of the canvas and for the ball uh, we use the black color and just remember to click this visible and for the test uh, just simply input red, uh, green and blue and it's pretty much about the designer let's move to the blocks now in this app what we want to do is to get uh, the color the RGB values uh, that we just touch so we need uh, to find a uh, function of our canvas touch so when we touch the canvas we will have three different items here the X Y and touch any sprite here um, I think is about the image in this canvas X Y is the pixel so when we click or we touch the canvas first of all we want to move our ball to that position so we call this ball dot move to function to our X and Y location Okay, this is the first step, and if you have our emulator set it, we can just try this function first to see if everything works fine. So let's open our emulator. Now here's our emulator, and if I click our canvas, uh, our little ball will move to the location where we just clicked so this function works fine and let's continue um, now we want to set our label to the RGB values so we should find the label dot test here and now I will introduce the join test function here this function will combine two different test items into one so if we have only one label but we want to have multiple tests we have to join them first into one element and here because we have so many items we can also set it later with RGB so the first item is red and also we need one more so it's a multiple join function joining together Okay, maybe I do it in another way, like this. So, to get our color, we need to go to Canvas and search. Yeah, it's here the get pixel color function. But before we can directly put it here, we need to 
change the format of our data because this function will return a color and not an RGB value. So first we get our pixel color and it returned three values, the RGB. So remember that in previous lessons, um, when we generate a color, we use the make color function, and this time we need to do it reversely. So we need to split the color back into the RGB value. So we use this function. And also since it's the red, we only need the first item, we go to the list and we can find here we pack an item in a list with an index. So we select list item and the index should be 1 because um, RGB and red is number 1. So this is the first color. So we can simply test this function only showing the red color. Uh, let's open our emulator again and we can find it. Now as you can see our red color can change from 255 to any other numbers so it works pretty fine and now we need to do the same thing to uh, our remaining color uh, the green and also the blue so we can simply copy this and just change the words And also remember to change the index. After we have set up three different functions, uh, for the RGB, we also need to combine them back. So we are going to use the join test function with free with free inputs for our red, green, and also blue. And I also want to use a slash to uh, divide our data. Actually, we don't need it for the blue, so I can. I will just delete it. And this should be what we only need for this application. So now we can test it with our emulator. I think it should be correct. Now, if we go to blue, uh, the blue value will be high. And if we go to red, the red is the largest. And the green, the green will be the largest. And if we point to the center about the white color, all values should be around 250 something. And this is our uh, 
get pixel color and also the test joint function tutorials in App Inventor and um, starting from this week um, we will no longer have a fixed update schedule on the App Inventor tutorial series because I have already planned it on another programming tutorials so I would put the App Inventor tutorial series here if I find any um, interesting or very useful function and I want to introduce those to you guys I will make another video and upload it but um, for the frequent update uh, I will focus on another tutorial series then so see you guys in the future